Hey guys, my name is Jill Wagner. I'm a National Marketing Director out of Park Hills, Missouri. And Kurt Beavers asked me if I would create something that um, talks about our ad tag message system and then how we're using that in our team. So I just wanted to share a little bit with you. This is not going to be super professional. <laughs> this is just my experience and what we're doing as a team. So the, how this started was a few months back. Actually, it's been probably close to a year ago. I was looking for a system. I was looking for something that I could plug people into, people that were coming from my TikTok or my social media, something that I could plug them into where I didn't lose them, even if they decided that they didn't want to order right then, but they were a part of my network. And so um, I had reached out to some other people that are leaders in other companies. To be honest, I have a mastermind group that I talk with other leaders in other companies, and it's very beneficial. We share ideas. And multiple of these people were talking about a system called ad tag message. And I was like, or the ATM system. And I'm like, I have no idea what you guys are talking about. And I'm like, are you serious? Like, you've never heard of this? No, I had never heard of it. So I came back to my group and went upline into my group and found out that my upline, Christine April, had heard of it. And um, she was using her page that she had, she had kind of revamped her page and all of that and was using it sometimes in her system. And so um, I asked her if I could model her system. So I'm not taking credit for this. The what I modeled on my Facebook page was modeled after Christine Abrel's page. So I just want you to know that. And then we have implemented the ad tag message system more so into our group and trying to even get better than that. And what I'm going to encourage you and share with you is that this is not something that happens overnight. This is a process. And um, we've had a lot of changes in our marketing plan and our corporate, just like in all things in our company, I feel like that we've had a lot of changes. And so I wanted to slowly roll this out to my team and I wanted it to be something that they could grasp onto and that we could continually do over time. So like I said, it's a process. I do not have this mastered by any means, but I wanna share it with you all because I think it's very beneficial. We're seeing it being beneficial on our team. Other teams are doing it too. Shelly Mackey was naturally doing it without even knowing that it was called the ad tag message system. So some of you may already be doing it, but I want to share a little bit about that. So years ago, we were encouraged to have our own customer groups, right? And so Rhonda Hubbard's my upline, and her and I decided to have our own customer group. So if you don't already currently have a customer group, it may be beneficial for you to partner with someone else to use other sidelines or to use other people to get this group up and running because it does take some teamwork. If you already have your own customer group, I would encourage you to use it. I already had my own customer group. So that one, we called it One Simple Change and Loving It. And it was our customer page, but it was stagnant. It was stale. It wasn't very valuable to people. And so once I saw Christine's page, I'm like, we're revamping this. And so I took time over quarantine while we were quarantined to revamp our Facebook page. And so I'm going to show that to you. And I would encourage you if you already have your own customer page to use that. So basically what this is, is a system that you are adding people into your customer page, you're tagging them in something and you're messaging them. So before I ever add them into the group, as soon as I get a prospect. So let's say I'm out at the grocery store and I'm talking to someone and you know, like normally we give a business card and we get that information. I'm adding them into my Facebook instead right away. So I'm adding them into my Facebook and I'm saying, hey, we have this Living Well community group. It is amazing. Can I add you into this group? They're standing right there with me. A lot of times they're standing right there with me and they're saying, absolutely. And so I'm adding them on Facebook right then. Hit, you know, hit accept on that. And then they're added, being added into the group and they have to hit accept on that. So let me screen share here. I have this that I will put out to you all um, so that you can see it. I just created this little flyer here. Add tag message system. So first you're adding your new prospect or customer to our Facebook group. So I went back to my team and I asked them, can you go add all of your customers? Can we be sure that we're adding new customers into this group? And um, we're not really welcoming them, anything like that, but we're tagging them in something. So it's not like, hey, welcome so-and-so to our group. No, it's tagging them in something. And then, you, so you're tagging them. Number two is tag, tag your prospect in either the pinned post or another video that you want them to, them to see. And then the third piece of that is that you're messaging them. You are messaging your prospect to let them know that you added them to the group so that they can accept it. And now they are, are a part of our community with a heart. So what that looks like, um, 
Let me move this. That's my mastermind group they're talking. Okay, so this is what our page looks like, the Living Well community. My team leaders came up with this. They came up with the name. They came up with Embrace, Become, and Inspire. Um, that's what our group is all about. And so if you go down through here, there is discussions and all of that that you can see. And there are right here under guides. This is the part that I want you to really take a look at. So underneath guide, we have guide one, your journey matters. There is a welcome message for me that's written out. There's also a welcome video that's written out so that people can see that. Guide two is all about our farm fresh nutrition. These are links from our corporate office that we were given that we can use, you know, to put out to people here. So it's all about our farm fresh nutrition. Guide three is all about the trio blend. All of this in a capsule, crazy good. There's different things there. Guide four, all about the omega. Guide five is all about the complete. Six is tower garden. Seven is healthy starts for families. And y'all, you don't have to do this exactly like I have. I'm just showing you as an example because I'm a visual learner too. Guide eight is what sets us apart and it talks about our clinical research. Guide nine is our medical professionals weigh in. I have Dr. Valerie Miles. I have Casey Schloss's link here. Um, guide 10 is a company with a heart. So I don't have a lot about our mission on here, but I wanted something if somebody is interested to be able to find it. Guide 11 is join our mission and there's um, different links there. Guide 12 is about um, the shred. And I don't know how I got there. <laughs> okay, here we go. Guide 12 is about the shred. Guide 11 is our recipes. So we were having so much trouble sometimes finding these recipes, finding out how to send them to people. So now let's say I want to tag someone in the puppy chow. I am going right here to the, um, to the puppy chow one and I'm tagging them in this post. You can see people already have done that right here. They're tagging them in this post and they're like, hey, this is the recipe right here that you're looking for. Tag someone there, okay? So it's our complete recipes there. Uh, if you keep going down, guide 14 is our smoothies. Guide 15 is meal prep. Guide 16 is real people and real stories. And these are links that were um, like from military teachers and athletes that were on that we found through Juice Plus. So you can see how the guides work there. And what you're going to do if you go back into discussion here, you can see how people are posting. So you're going to want moderators and administrators on your, on your page because you don't want people to be posting things that aren't relevant to the page. We want the page to be of valuable. We have rules written out right here, but we want pay, the page to be valuable for people. We want it to be encouragement. We want it to be um, real life type stuff and about health and about what we're doing to continually get better. So we have recently, since I talked to Shelly Mackey, we have recently started on putting our shred on this page as well. So we used to have a separate shred page that I did with my upline. And now our shred, we're actually doing on here. It's going to take it a little bit to grow. I understand that. So one of our shred coaches, we have shred coaches every month. One of our shred coaches is Brittany. So she is just posting on here some of the stuff of how she makes her complete shakes. You can see there. Um, she's showing it right there. Another shred coach we have is Taylor and Taylor showing some of her stuff here. So right now we are admit, admit in the middle of the shred. So you can see these girls as our shred coaches commenting daily because they are um, the coaches of our shred right now. So just an idea there of kind of what that looks like. There's other people who have been chiming in. Um, Angela is a, a customer and a team member and she was just chiming in there about her family as well, that she had some free time drinking her shake, some encouragement, stuff like that. So I will say there are also, so here's Taylor talking here, and there are also stories. So this is a pharmacist on my team and she is a pharmacist turned into pharmacist. And um, so she is sharing her story here. We're very careful not to make any claims, anything like that, um, and to make it just what corporate would want out of those videos. But if I have someone who's another pharmacist and I want them to hear Sarah's story, instead of me having to get Sarah on a three-way connection call right away and all of that, I'm just tagging them right here in her video so that they know that it's right there. So I'm adding them to the page. I'm tagging them in a video, whether it's a corporate video or someone's personal story that I want them to hear. I'm tagging them in that. And then I'm messaging that person. And I'm saying, hey, I just wanted you to know that I added you to the page, I tagged you in this video and I would love your feedback. So then 
they have to go in and accept the invitation and see where they're tagged. And I can see that they have accepted the invitation. I can see where they have commented back. Or I'll even say, you know, when you see it on there, um, tag or, you know, right, got it or something underneath there to where I know that you saw it. And then I'm following up with them. The wonderful thing about this, in my opinion, is that it's giving people an opportunity to get that third party validation right away. And if they decide that they're not ready to order yet, they are a part of my community. They're a part of our community, Juice Plus community, a community with a heart, a company with a heart. They are a part of that all at one time. And I love that because they're in our system now. And maybe they did order and maybe they just ordered the duo, but they're going to see things pop up here about the shakes. They're going to see Omega stuff pop up. They're going to see, you know, vineyard blend stuff pop up or bars. And then they're probably going to be like, oh gosh, well, there's more to this. Or maybe they're going to hear someone's story. And so there's so many facets to it that I love because it's all right here in one place. So um, like I said, we just started doing the shred on here. We do not have um, this perfected by any means, but we're getting better. Our group is growing. We have over a thousand members in our group right now, 1.1. And um, we're continually growing. And you guys can look over here at your growth chart. And what I like to do is just make sure that it's going up. So I know that people are being added. And it may not be going up as fast as I would like it to, but it's continually going up. And I love that. And so um, some of you are probably wondering, so how, how do I start this? How do I incorporate it? <laughs> I would say, first of all, your guides. Do your guides all at one time. If you don't have a group yet and you're creating a brand new group, before you add everyone, get your guide set up because it does notify people every time something's updated and that can be kind of annoying. So I went to my people, I posted a video first and I said, hey, just want you to know, I'm gonna be changing some stuff on this group. And so you're gonna get a lot of notifications. And after that, it's gonna be so much better and more valuable. So I just kind of gave them a heads up on that group. Um, you're also gonna want the buy-in from your team. My team leaders came up with the name. They came up with you know all of the things there too. I put that in there. I mimic that after Christine's page, but it's been a group effort. And so it's not just Jill doing it. It's a team effort. It's a group effort. And I cannot do it alone. You're going to want people. You're going to want the leaders on your team or sidelines, whatever that looks like for you to jump in and to, you know, to really help bring value to the page. And how are we getting it out there to people? So I do a monthly team call. Rhonda and I do our weekly team call, but my team specifically does once a month. And we're talking about this on our team call. Month after month, we're talking about our team call. This is how we add someone. And we're do, leading by example. So if I have someone brand new and maybe they haven't joined my team yet, they joined as a customer, I'm adding them in. If they joined as a team member, I'm adding them in. I'm tagging them, them in something. I'm showing them that example right from the get-go so that they can do it for their people too. And then we're also, I'm putting out Boxer messages um, to our team reminding them about what this looks like, adding people, tagging people, messaging people, add people to the group. It's not something, like I said, that people get right away. It's a process. And so that's how we're adding people. I'm finding it um, very beneficial to have it all in one place. Whenever we get a lot of people you know, over there, it's a fantastic way to give that people value. People are in that group that have been customers that may be canceled that are coming back, you know? And um, the more interaction, the more value, the better it is for everyone. So I think I've covered everything. It's definitely a more automated system. I was looking for a more, more automated system. I'm looking at my notes over here. I was looking for a more automated system. I was looking for something to plug my people into. And this has given me just that. Um, now, my people that I'm using for my platform of TikTok, I'm also bringing over not only into the Facebook page group, I'm bringing them into my Instagram. I'm growing my Instagram with that. I'm growing my project broadcast with that too. So it's not just a one end all be all. I think there's lots of different things that we can, we can use to get better and we can use for different people. And so I just really do love this idea of giving people, our customers and our prospects that support right away, right there on Facebook. So hope that helps. Thank you guys for listening. If you have questions, I'd be happy to answer them. Just feel free to reach out and I will also pop the flyers I have specific ones for my team. I'll pop that in there so you can see it. But then I have generic ones that you guys could just share out with your teams too that I'll pop in the chat. So thank you. Have a great day.